Okay, guys, we're going on a walk. Very nice outside. Um, see, let's go. So we're outside with the vibes today. It's really nice. Metro, what you doing, man? You hanging out too? Okay, guys, this is the before of the room. We are definitely changing this around. Take a good look. You guys will see once the transformation begins. All right, guys, so a quick update. We got everything sold in the room. I put a Craigslist ad up yesterday. So I put a Craigslist ad up, a Facebook Marketplace ad, and an offer up ad, and it eventually got sold on Craigslist, which I didn't even think it would, it would have been sold on Craigslist quicker than offer up. But I had an inquiry on Facebook Marketplace, but she wanted like half the pieces and not the full set. So I was able to sell the entire set, everything down to the rug in one swoop for, and I sold it for 265 for all, everything, the uh, bed frame, the two nightstands, the two lamps, the dresser, and the rug. And she, she took all of it, which I'm so happy. So that's done and that's gone. Um, so my sister is actually taking this mattress because it's a really nice too low mattress. Um, so she's going to be taking that. She just needs a new mattress and I don't need any more so she can have that. And now we are left with this. I have baby right there. But we've got everything here. Everything's gone. These are just things that are in that dresser. I'm about to go through and see like what I want. And here's our little desk situation. We're going to revamp that as well. The TV's probably going to stay in here, but we're definitely going to change out this whole little situation it's sitting on. Um, and that's also some of Mario stuff. So I'm going to try to clear this room out and then figure out what we're going to do. What's going on, Bob? You got the toy in your hand. You got the toy. You're sliding down, Bob. There you go. a little upset he has not taken one nap today really only nap he's taken has been like 15 minutes so that's awesome but yeah I'm so happy I was able to sell that stuff so fast um, I'm about to go through these clothes see if I even want any of this stuff and then uh, vacuum up here and then just have like a clean slate so I can really start planning what I want to do in this room I'm so excited are you excited guest bedroom slash den slash office all that good stuff I'm trying to figure out how i want to put furniture when we do get furniture in um so far i tried out the desk in this corner but i don't know if this is like what i'm going for i don't know if it should be in this corner or on this corner and then this wall be where the day bed is or this wall be where the day bed is I don't know. Okay guys, just doing some playing around in this room again. So what I have is you walk in, I'm thinking daybed on this wall, maybe two sh nice shelves on either side, daybed in the middle, plant in the corner, and then when you pan over, the desk is in this corner. I don't know what to do with the TV yet, but desk nook is over in the corner here. So it has own little separate space. But then the day bed area is all in the middle with like a nice rug um, space here. I think that looks a little bit better. It makes the bigger wall be like the feature wall with the day bed and the nice pillows and all that good stuff. I don't know. What do we think? 
Another idea. Just got my green chef delivery. Let me show you guys what I got. Uh, I'm Amari, and we just love it, and it's just stuck, so. About three, are you, are you there any days on Friday? Well, we got four meals <laughs> to try out. We got four meals. Um, I actually was watching Julia and Hunter Havens, and she gave out a code 90Julia, which I used, and I got a good little sale off of this box. So I got the mushroom and Swiss burgers. I got the salmon with red pepper sauce. I did the Peruvian chicken with ahi verde. And then I got the mojito shrimp. And then I did like the balanced living meals with Green Chef. You can even do vegan, I think. There's three options, but I did the balanced living one, which is like meat and veggie living. So they each come in their own little bag, just like Hello Chef. And right at my door, easy, especially for right now with baby. We need easy meals. And all of the meats are in here too. So we got chicken, ground beef, shrimp, and salmon. So nice. Everything's here. And they put these really nice big ice packs to keep all of your produce and meat fresh. All right, so I just wanted to mention when I was saying that Green Chef has different types of plans, you could do keto and paleo, plant powered or balanced living. So we did the balanced living, which has like meat, seafood and vegetarian choices. The plant powered is plant-based for next level vegans, vegetarians and meat eaters alike. And then the keto and paleo, is like watching your carbs and some of these that i got are like gluten free a lot of the ones that i got are gluten free outside of the mushroom and swiss burgers because of the bun but everything else was gluten free which was nice and some of them were like pescatarian a lot of these were outside the chicken and the beef so balance you know a little bit of balance all right guys so i did not vlog last night but we end up we ended up eating one of the green chef meals and we had the um burger with swiss cheese and mushrooms it was so good i think tonight we're gonna do the salmon with red pepper sauce um just because i don't like salmon to sit too long so yeah i need to show you guys the updates that i did in the office i just bought some new like one new thing for the office and my parents are actually picking up the day bed that i want to go in there from ikea today so that's happening um then we have to build that you know how ikea furniture is i'm dreading it but um outside of that um i have two like youtube things that i need to do on the side i have a box that i need to unbox and make a video for and i have a 30 day time period in which i have to do it and i'm coming down to that 30 days so i have to do that like I have to figure out, like, I have to do it tomorrow. I mean, I have to do that. I have to do it before March is up, definitely. Um, so I have to do that. And I have to do a blog reached out to me. Um, it's about, like, unique baby names. And they want to do a post on crew. So they gave me a questionnaire to fill out. And they said that they could either call me or I could just fill out the questionnaire. And I just said, let me just do the questionnaire because then I don't have to actually be on the phone with anyone. Um you know, having to deal with crew. So I got the questionnaire yesterday and I need to figure that, I need to fill that out and be done with that. So yeah, two things I need to do. Crew just went down for a nap. So he is sleeping. This is my baby. And yeah, I'm catching up on This Is Us. It's actually really good. It's so relatable this season because it's all about new babies and you know, we just had a baby so. Um, I'm watching the one where they like come back from the hospital with the babies and it's just really, I love This Is Us. If you guys don't know, if you guys don't watch that show, definitely watch it. It's such a feel good show. Um, just about life. It's just literally about life. And this season is so relatable because it's all about babies and like becoming a new mom and postpartum and all that good stuff. So um yeah it's really good so i'm just catching up on that i completely like missed like four episodes so I'm watching that on hulu um but yeah i'm gonna show you guys what is going on in the office space and i'll see you guys in a second all right so this is the current state of the office space i did put the desk in this corner because i thought that would be a really good place for it um this big monitor is for my job they actually sent that to me 
in the mail, so I have to have this because it's my second screen when I'm working. Um, so yeah, this is the desk. I was about to get a new desk and buy a new one, but for now, I'll just deal with this one. This one's from Target. I got it a while ago, probably when we were living in Falls Church, um, but I've had this for a while. The desk chair is definitely gonna go. That has been with me since I lived in Richmond. So that has got to go. So I'm on the hunt for a new office chair, for sure. Um, then this in this corner, I got this plant like two days ago. I went to Marshall's and I got the stand and the plant um, separate from the store. Um, together it was like $70 because the plant was $45 and the stand was $16 and I got like one other thing. But I really love this. I hadn't seen a fake plant for $45. They've always been like $60, $70. So I definitely snagged this one when I saw it. Um, and I just put it in this... Um, like wicker kind of basket thing. It has some black detailing on it and this was $16.99 or $15.99. I love how it elevates it from the floor some because it's already like kind of short. So that's like the little fake plant situation that I've got going on in this room and I just put it in the corner for now. I think that's where it's going to stay. Then you guys know I got this from my um, recent Marshalls haul like some weeks ago. I just have to find a vase for that. Um, and then I might utilize, not this one, but this mirror in this room. I got this some years ago, but I just have that available. But this is kind of like the color scheme I'm going for. Um, the, the day bed is black framed, so it's going to be, you know, black. But I'm going to mix um, different colors and shades by the pillows that I'm going to put on it which is gonna give it like a modern rustic kind of boho feel. I do have white curtains and I'm gonna do a black curtain rod across the top um, for this space as well. But I'm also looking at some uh, leaning bookshelves for either side of the day bed. Let me know what you guys think about that. I'm either gonna do that or I'm gonna do a little like table to go next to the side of one of the sides of the day bed. I don't know yet, but I really like the look of shelves because it adds more to the wall. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. But I'm so excited to get this room sorted. I start work in 11 days. So this is my like project that I wanna have somewhat put together before I start work. Um, I'm so excited to get started on it. So we're making progress, slowly but surely. Okay guys, I got my Nespresso order in the mail. This came so fast. I got a little welcome thing and I did uh, put in two um, return boxes for my pods, like return bags. So when you fill this bag up, you can drop these off at a UPS um, drop box or whatever and you can recycle all the pods, which I thought was really cool about their system. So that's cool. So I got two of these bags. These are free to get off their website when you place an order. And I'll show you guys the pods that I got. So I got the caramel cookie pods. I got a lot of the barista creations. I actually got all barista creation pods because I feel like that's the type of coffee that I like. So I got the caramel cookie. I got the vanilla custard pie, which I'm super excited to try this one out because people say they love it. I got the Bianca Forte, which I tried in the sample and it was really good. So I got that one. And then I also got the Hazelino Muffin, which I feel is like hazelnut, and I love hazelnut. So Mario likes these types of flavors too, so I think that we're going to really like these. All right, guys, so I also placed an order with H&M, and I wanted to do a quick um, like call for you guys on what I got from H&M. It's all crew-related stuff. I wanted to just place a baby order, and I actually placed some stuff there. I ordered in size 4 to 6 just cause it'll be bigger and babies grow every day. So I just figured I'll size up with my ordering. And some things I got in nine months because they only had that size available and I just wanted to get it. So let's start it out. So I got him this little hat, this little cute sun hat. I think this one's so much cooler than the one I got on Amazon. This one is six months. Everything's gonna be four to six months unless I say so. So I got this little sun hat, the little thing coming down. So cute. Crew's getting ready for bed. <laughs> I also got this onesie, super cute. It's like teal color, so I got that. Then I got him, I'll 
sure that's last. But I got him this set. This little shirt and pants set. Striped like brown color, super cute. Then I got this onesie, it has little cars on it and it's like this cream color. I thought that was really cute. It's also zip, zip onesie. This is another zip onesie that came in a pack of two. It's green color. Got him these cute little shorts. These are so cute. Came in a blue and a yellow two pack. Then I got this two pack of joggers, one cream color and one brown like color. I love these colors for my baby. Super cute. And I got this striped onesie. This one is button with brown stripe. And then I got him this one, speckled one. This one's also button. Then I got him this whole like five pack of brown and white like basic shirts. So I got him that. Then last but not least, I got this little like summer outfit. I got this one in a nine month um, and the shirts were nine month as well. I thought that was so cute, little shorts with his little arms out. And he's so cute in the summer. That's my little haul. Let me go tend to my baby now. All right guys, it is Friday. Uh, crew just went down for a nap. I'm gonna do the dishes. I try to do things when he goes right down for a nap so I can have some sense of like getting things, something done during the day. I have not been able to do those two things I told you guys I need to do, so I really need, tomorrow's Saturday, so Vario will be home, but um, I really need to do that. I honestly, I start work back up in a week. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. Like, I really don't. It's just gonna have to happen and like, I'm just gonna have to figure out a groove for myself. I don't know. I'm really anxious about it. So if you guys have any tips, let me know. Especially like working from home and balancing like being a mom and also working. I just have to figure out what I'm gonna do. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna load this dishwasher. So enjoy the time lapse. Also, if you have not tried Chipotle's quesadillas. They are so good. It's new on the menu, so definitely try it out. I'm actually having one delivered right now because they are so good, like amazing. I love quesadillas, so check it out. Got my lunch delivered. I told y'all it's fire. Yes. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. What purse is that by? We got it from Ross. Make sure we get pictures from you. The monument. Living in DC, we see these all the time and everyone has never seen this and like it's so weird because I don't realize that some people never see them in Washington monuments and I always see them. I've seen them all my life, so fun fact. Good morning guys, it is Sunday, March 28th. I had a really good time yesterday with my sister's birthday dinner. Um, my sister turned 17 yesterday, so we went out for a dinner and went by the monuments as you guys saw. The food was excellent. We love that place. Um, it's called Carlisle in Arlington. It's so good. But um, yeah, that was really nice. I got out the house for a little bit yesterday. It's super raining today. I wanted to show you guys some updates to the room upstairs, which is gonna be like our office space, den space, guest space. And we got the day bed from Ikea. So we actually um, built that two nights ago. Um, so it's all built. I just have to now set it up and f decorate it up. I'm so excited for this part. I'm gonna get some really nice decorative like pillows to go on the day bed and nice bedding. I can't wait to do it. I'm also gonna do some frames um, on top of the day bed. So let me, guys, let me show you guys what it looks like. This is the day bed. It pulls out to be a full bed um, when we have guests or like two guests. Um, right now it's in the twin bed setup, but you can pull it out and extend it and it makes a full bed, which I loved about this day bed. This is from Ikea. It's the Fraysdale bed. And the bed by itself is 199, 
when you get two mattresses they have a sale right now and it's 359 so i went ahead and got that for this room i thought it was going to be nice and minimal you know for this space i love the black color i think i can really dress it up um so yeah i'm gonna do two twin white sheets on these mattresses and then going to do like some really nice bedding a nice throw tucked in it's just gonna look so good um I'm gonna get some really nice decorative pillows, like throw pillows to go all on the back side so that during the day when we don't have anybody in this room, which it's mainly gonna be like a couch setup. So I'm super excited to dress this up. And then above this space, I'm gonna do a lot of prints, various prints with, um, you know, some Etsy prints that I found and some nice frames all on this wall. I'm super excited. I don't know what I'm doing with this TV yet. I was thinking about mounting it but I'm weird about making holes in walls, so I don't know about that yet. But yeah, I definitely wanna get a little um, side table that goes on the side. This is leaving, my sister's taking that. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited about it. I like that it extends when we have guests that need to sleep in here, but for the most part, it's gonna be a nice setup, like couch aesthetic, and I'm super excited about it. So this is the room so far. We're making really quick progress. Um, I'm going into my last week of maternity leave and I really wanna make this office space feel super inviting and comfortable. So that's my goal for this week. I need to be able to just go to the store. I need to go to Target, Marshall's Home Goods and just look around and see how I can decorate the space. So if you guys have any suggestions, let me know. Happy Sunday guys. Today we're gonna to go uh, to the store as a family. I'm gonna go to Target. I wanna get some stuff for this new daybed space. Um, do some decor shopping, figure out what we're gonna eat this week. I have no idea. We did really good last week because I went on Pinterest and just found some recipes, but I have not done that this week. So I might just pick up some snacks, <laughs> honestly, because I don't know what to make this week yet, but um, we're gonna go. I have some stuff I wanna get from Target, especially like some throw pillows that I see they're in stock. And I'm just gonna see what else they have in the home decor section. And there's a TJ Maxx right by the Target that we're gonna go to. So we're gonna go there and super excited. I hope you X right. Good morning. Good morning, it's another morning. It's Monday morning. So baby is sleeping. It is like 8.30 right now. Yeah, it's like 8.30. Let me check. Oh no, it's nine. My eyes are so itchy from allergies and pollen. Oh my God. But anyways, I made myself a coffee. I used the Bianca Forte pod this morning. Um, baby sleep in his bassinet. I did get sheets for the day bed yesterday, but this is not what you would see. I'm gonna get a throw that's going to basically be like covering the whole bottom part just to give some color. But I just got these sheets from Target. They were only $9, so I got white sheets and I am gonna put a throw over the entire thing to cover it up. So you're not even gonna see the sheets, but it's more so for like guest purposes, so. Um, I'm looking at throw pillows that I want to get because I want to cover the entire, like, all this, like, the entire boundary with pillows. Um, so I am looking up some pillow covers. I'm trying to see if I want to order some pillow covers from H&M and just buy some Amazon pillow inserts. I've also seen some on Target that I really like, so stay tuned for that. So we got the black curtain rod from Target yesterday. So I'll show you guys what that looks like when we put the curtains up. We are just putting up these white curtains. Um, so yeah, lots of exciting things happening. This is my last week of maternity leave. I'm so sad. Um, you guys will definitely be on the journey with me as I ease back into work life. So definitely look forward to that. I, I'm not looking forward to it, but we're gonna make it fun and we're gonna look forward to it. You know, we gotta be positive because it's gonna happen regardless, so. Yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the shit out of this last week. I'm gonna milk it, I'm gonna do everything. I really wanna do some big work on this room this week. That's my one, number one goal. I'm on the hunt for a rug in here, the throw pillows, um, a lamp. I found a lamp I like on Target, so 
I might order that. Um, so yeah, good things happen. Sorry I didn't really get to vlog yesterday in the store. It was just a lot like going to the store with a new baby is another level of anxiousness. So I did not do that. But Crew's taking a nap right now. I did go to Marshall's and TJ Maxx today to try to get some stuff for this day bed situation. And I'll show you guys what I got. All right, so I went to Marshall's and I went to TJ Maxx and I got some things, so I'll show you guys what I got. Sorry, I'm like sitting weird. But, so from TJ Maxx, I got some pillows. So I got this set of two pillows. They're kind of like this beigey off-white color. These were $29.99, I believe. Yeah. $29.99 and I got a set of two. So I really wanted to get a two pack because I want to fill this whole thing with like pillows. So I got that. Then I got this pillow. This one was $19.99. It has really nice fringe on the sides. This really cool pattern. So I got that one. And I got this one, which is like a long pillow with some tassels. And this one was $24.99. Throw pillows are very expensive, so I got these to start out with just to see how they look on the bed, and then I will go back and regroup once I see like what I've got. Um, and then in Marshalls, I got two throws for the day bed, so I got this one. It has some tassels on it. It's like this black and beige color. This one was $24.99, so I got that one. Thick blanket. And then I got this one because I thought this would look really good to layer. So I got this one, which is like this quilted material. This one was $19.99. So yeah, it's like this quilted beige color. And that's everything that I got. So let me dress it up, put it on the bed, and then I'll show you guys what I come up with. blanket but I don't know what do we think about this setup I need to get one more of these padded blankets <coughs> sorry I need to get one more of these padded blankets for on this side and then I think it'll look really good because then I can cover up this sheet but I really like it I need to get another pillow for over here but it looks really good it's exactly what I was looking for it's coming together super nice I love the double layering of these throws looks so good and just like that crew is awake so i'm glad i was able to get this done but i definitely want to get one of more of these padded blankets for right over here i think that would look really good um but yeah i love how it looks i'm still on the hunt for a rug i have some prints off of etsy that i want to print and put in frames for above here uh we got to put the curtains up that's what we're going to do today and they're just white curtains and i still need a lamp for over here got the plant over there i love that so yeah i love how it looks so far <laughs> 